and Draker goes for the big hit. Could be caught, and that's well held. Good catch by Kevin Dewars. And away goes Mandraker. It's 168 for four. Trying to get it over extra cover, I fancy. Not able to do that. And the way that this is caught is interesting. He's come down, given himself some room. And watch how he tries to take it reverse cup. And then the ball is so low, he has to catch it in an orthodox manner. So he almost cocked it up there. But however, the Indians have lost their fourth wicket at 168. Well, again, Tricos has bowled this over very well indeed. Four balls gone, only three runs scored. Ambly down he goes, and uh, what's the story here? Is he stumped? He's wandering off. Or was he bowled? Let's have a look. Pitching just outside off. Just brushed the off stump, didn't it? Well, I think it was bowled without question. Bail comes off before uh, the ball sort of rebounds back. So he's gone, bowled. So away goes Campbell. One run he got, 170 for five. Jedidah's down the ground too. He might be caught, is he? Ali Shah has got a, a marvellous catch by Ali Shah. It looks for a moment as if it might not quite have carried, but to compensate, Shah pushed himself forward. And Jadija has gone, caught by Shah, bowled by Tricos for a six. It's 182 for six now. Well, this is Tricos' third wicket. He's deserved it. He's bowled very well, but uh, a bit of loft in there. That's a very good diving catch low down. It might be the one of Rob Latham uh, dismissing one of the Australians just a, a week or so ago. Jeff Marsh. That's right. And so that's the sixth Indian wicket down, 182 for six in the 30th over.